hey, this is Redder Up. Uh, you know, I was thinking about the people who are questioning what is what is actually the point of rewriting the world editor? Why have a custom world editor? You know, a custom view, maybe a custom object editor. And I wanted to illustrate something here that I was able to do with this is a custom object editor I wrote. And just by having the source code of the object editor, you can add the ability to select an entire race, like the entire night elves, hit control C, hit control V, paste them, and have it paste a custom night elf race where all the unit IDs line up and reference each other correctly. So the tree of life, E0D, upgrades to E0E, builds E0, Ancient of War builds E2, E3, E5, which up here is Archer, Huntress, Glaive Thrower. And everything links together correctly as units and what it trains and what it builds. The Wisp correctly builds, E, D, G, N, all these very various IDs. I have just duplicated the Night Elves. Um, for all you guys, this would probably take like hours or something. And this is real. This is, this is serious. We're going to save as serious right now. I could import this file that I made, and suddenly, see, you think I'm kidding, but this is now actually the real world editor. Now these units are actually totally real, and someday well, this would just be real in that program we just saw. I just go to the custom tab, and I have the entire uh, Night Elf race. I have custom Wisp, I have custom these guys, uh, and they all are going to build each other if I test. See that? Custom.